guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be using my brother se 400 it is an older machine it's kind of like the se 625 but it has a 4x4 hoop size and I'm going to be stitching out a baseball cap and I wanted to use this machine instead of my PE 800 just to show some people what you can make with the 4x4 size hoop now this machine is discontinued but if you have a 4x4 hoop size you can see that you're able to stitch out a hat on it as well what I'm doing right now is marking the center of my stabilizer and I'm going to draw some lines so that I can see how to position the hat on the stabilizer even up now each machine comes with the plastic grid I no longer have that so this is what I use to do it I'm going to also use some spray adhesive just so that it can help me stick my hat down on the hoop and keep it stable. You don't have to use the spray adhesive. It's a personal choice. You can just use pins and it can be perfectly fine. I just like to use the adhesive. So I'm using the lines on my hat with the lines that I drew on top of the stabilizer to kind of line my hat up where I want it so that it is even. So now I'm just going ahead and making sure that I smooth the hat down completely to where it's on the hoop. Any creases or anything, wrinkles, I'm going to mash those down and kind of smooth it out to where every part that's on the hoop is nice and flat. Now that I have my hat flat like I want it, I'm going to go ahead and take some pins and go all the way around the hat. I like to use the pins with the adhesive spray because it just adds a little more security to it. So I'm just going around the hat all the way, adding any pins where I feel like there needs to be some. And I'm going to go ahead and put my hat on the machine. Once it is on the machine, I'm going to go ahead and pull it closer to where you guys can see. So now I'm going to go ahead and hit the adjust button on the screen and to see where I want the image positioned on my hat. Once you're on this part of the screen, you can move the arrows up, down, across both ways until you feel comfortable with where your design is. You can do it as many times as you like. I'm comfortable with where my design is, so I'm going to go ahead and let it start stitching out.
now that it's all done i think that the design stitched out really well i love the way it's positioned and centered on the hat it's not too high up it's not too low i definitely could have went a little bit lower on the design but i did try it on and i like the way that it looks if you have any questions about this video any questions about this machine leave a comment down below don't forget to like the video if you're new to my channel and you enjoy watching embroidery videos sublimation or any kind of craft video go ahead and subscribe to my channel and make sure the bell is turned on and i will see you in the next one guys thank you